Cafe Isabel Strawberry Shortcake started in an era when there was really hardly any imports. It started in the late 80s. And of course, you could get the strawberries from Baguio, but they, they were very fragile. To, to put it on a cake and innovate your own style, because strawberry shortcake is basically sponge cake, cream, and strawberry, and that's it. But the way we put it, we want the Filipino taste of condensed milk or yema to go with it. We wanted other things to go with an intense flavored strawberry shortcake. And by the 90s, we had strawberry overload. It's a strawberry shortcake with literally one kilo of strawberries. They, they, it could fall apart. People rush to their homes to bring it and keep it intact, but it's... So we use a mix of local no? and imported. We use imported strawberries for topping for the simple reason that they have you know, uniform size and, and uh, well, it's bigger and it lasts longer. And we use uh, local for the, what filling we, and glaze. Yeah, for the filling and glaze. So there, I mean, it, the formula works. So we're, that's the new, uh, like uh, the hybrid no? of uh, our strawberry shortcake. But it's pretty much the same as before. It just lasts longer now because the, the imported strawberries, for some reason, they last longer. 